Hello friend, this is Crave Autonics and today I have made a 3 bit shift resistor only using transistors and capacitors and resistors and few diodes so when I connect this battery 12 volt right now all are off we have to load the data by using this resistor by making any one of the latch high now what is a latch I will explain you so I have made this one a high and when I press this switch it generates a negative trigger which which shifts the data from here to from right to left so the data moves from left to right sorry data moves from left to right as we press this button now let's try loading 011 so the data is now 011 zero one one now rotate this one will shift here and this one will shift here that means this zero will shift here this zero has shifted here and this zero has shifted here now so this is the way it shift, shifts the data so it's a parallel to serial converter or a shift resistor you can say it. only using transistors so it's working is very simple uh, and you can also make it but I will rather explain you it in blocks and try to explain that how that block works in my further videos. So this working is very simple. It has it has got three latches L1, L2 and L3. Now what is a latch? A latch is a device which gets uh, which stores memory when you give it a positive high value. High value. This is a high value, positive 5 volt plus 5 volt so when we give it a high value it gets on and when we give it a low value it shuts off now we are using this diode so that none of them should interfere with each other the diodes only allow negative pulse to go through so here is our button if you will press this it will generate a negative pulse which will off all these latches but we don't want to get all off at the same time so if this one is high it should transfer it to here so if if this one gets off after some time after some few milliseconds it should pass the data to here so what we have done is we have added here one monostable multi vibrator so as soon as it gets off after some time it gives it gives a it gets on and which after it gets on that means it it will stay on but we don't want we want a pulse to activate this it should not stay on so when it rises this edge is detected and this positive edge trigger turns turns on this latch and and same blocks are repeated multi vibrator positive edge trigger and this positive edge no sorry multi vibrator positive edge trigger again goes to this latch